Wisconsin was buried five times by mile-thick glaciers. They came, they went. Uh, right now we're in... in, in Which has to do with nothing. It's driven by natural, powerful, natural, interconnected, very complex forces that we don't understand yet, and we certainly don't have any control. Paula, it's a, it's a really We're nice little shtick, but that's what you should be in jail for, is saying that kind of stuff. These are, what you're saying, oh, are demonstrable lies. Um, come hey, on. Paul, Paul hold off just a second. Have a debate on this, so this is, there is no debate, Paul. There is no debate. This is this 100% of the scientists in the world who are not funded by the fossil fuel industry would say that what you are engaging in is criminal racketeering. <laughs> that is an outrageous I'm, comment. It's you, just un-American. It's anti-freedom of speech. I know that's what the tobacco companies said when we called them on their lies, too. It's what the asbestos industry said when we called them on their lies. We're not talking asbestos. Or you are killing We're people, about. Paul. Um, You've got 5 million people. refugees, climate change refugees, fleeing Wait. into Europe right now because of the droughts in Syria. <laughs> that, that, Laughing that, doesn't make it less funny. real. I, the last I Dead children, Paul. Your responsibility. Not, it has nothing to do with a drought. They would stay there. They've been through droughts for hundreds of times in those areas. They're fleeing ISIS butchers who are beheading little children. They're not. It's all the consequence of climate change. Of climate change. It absolutely that is. is. While that California is, is burning, hilarious. the Middle East is dry. No, a million and a half farmers had to leave their farms five years ago in Syria and go into the cities because their their farms turned from productive farmland into desert land. And because they and, bombed. But and, and, they and the government's response was so brutal to those people it led to a civil war. Obviously, you have no interest. Just pot him down a little. You have no interest in having a conversation here because you're constantly trying to talk over me. Once again, Paul, why should you not be prosecuted for racketeering? I'm sorry? Why should you not be prosecuted for racketeering? Why, no why, racketeering. why should the fossil fuel denial industry? We're trying to have a debate, Tom. That's there is, what we're trying to do. We're having, I'm want, trying to have a discussion about whether or not you should be in jail. Figures that are not being brought out by the other side. But you're not, you're not, not debating me, Paul. I'm, I'm not being given much of a chance. Well, no, I've asked you over and over again. What? Okay, we're, we're out of time. Uh, Paul Dreesen, Senior Policy Analyst with cons- the Committee for a Constructive Tomorrow. 